welcome back to my channel you know it's make up this time I'm going to show you how to make a uh, <laughs> a little bit a scar with a uh, maggot uh, like this the cosmetic use uh, is mehron meritized AQ palette uh, I use basic palette and bio oil mehron sinwax mehron liquid latex this is uh, the big uh, the big bottle and this is a uh, little okay and this is some pincet for the first step I use mehron liquid latex uh, I put a little amount onto my hand and blend it and then I take a little amount of the sin wax. Sin wax is to use to make maggot and the rotten flesh. Then I pour a little amount of bio oil onto my hands. Uh, you can use a uh, beauty oil that you have. Uh, this oil helps me to mold the wax, uh, so the wax doesn't feel sticky onto my skin. I roll on the wax and. Cut it into a little pieces. You can make uh, maggots as many as you want. I take a big amount of the wax and put it on to my hand, which is I already applied the latex before, and blend it uh, the edge with uh, my finger by pressing it. I use bio oil to help me to smoothen the surface of the wax. Then I use uh, acne tools to rip off the surface of the wax to make a rotten flesh. Then I bench the maggots. Uh, I put onto the handle of the brush. And then I color the maggots with white color. Uh, I'm using Mehron Paradise EQ palette, which is it's water activated. So you need to wet your brush first before put the product and apply it onto the object and then I give a little tiny black hat with black color the brush I use is real technique fine liner and then to color the texture of the rotten flesh uh, I use black red uh, mixed with brown color sometimes a little bit green I use darker color to make the depth of the rotten flesh. Because Mehron Paradise EQ palette is water activated, so you need to be careful. Uh, don't need to uh, wet your brush too much because the water can release uh, the sin back from your skin. And then I apply a foundation to blend the color of the skin and my sin wax. And blend it uh, by tapping motion with my finger. Then I put uh, my guts onto my rotten flesh. I place it one by one. And I think this is the fun part doing this. Placing my guts uh, one by one onto the rotten flesh. This is so much fun. Then I reapply the color, the white color, uh, onto the maggot. 
because the color I already applied before is already off. Then I use acne tools to make a fine line onto the maggot uh, to make uh, the texture. So the maggot looks like a real life maggot. And then I also reapply uh, to give a little tiny black head. And give uh, a little bit detail onto the rotten flesh using a darker color. Mix black, uh, red, and brown, uh, and a little bit green to make a uh, color of the rotten flesh. While watching this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe my channel, and if you like this video, please give thumbs up. And drop down the comments below. I would like to see and read all your comments and give feedback. And don't forget to follow my Instagram account at Swarganinoaktan. Then I make braces uh, by tapping with my finger, uh, use a red, brown, and black color around the rotten flesh. Okay, this is the final look of the rotten flesh with maggots come out from inside the flesh. Um, I hope you enjoy and have a nice try. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!